It really shows how strong the economy is. It shows if consumers are, are able to go out and spend. If you're spending for your kids, you know, we're at the holidays right now. If you're looking to put uh, presents under the tree for your kids or celebrate for the holidays, you want to see, um, are you able to do that? The, the Federal Reserve wants to see, are they able to do that? And companies, as they're forecasting into 2024, uh, and they're getting a sense of how strong their consumer is, Retail sales are, are, are very important for them because they're going through their budgeting process right now and they need to get a better sense of has the consumer started to pull back on spending, what are the categories that they have, if they have at all, and what does that mean for my planning purposes going into 2024. We started marketing the holiday season back uh, in early November, uh, which is just a tad earlier than we normally start marketing. Normally it's more the middle of November. We started about a week earlier this year just because we saw everyone else doing it. And so uh, we, we fast followed and, and got our promos out also. Uh, well, actually, uh, normally for us, two days before Christmas is our busiest day of the year, which um, customers are going to wait a little bit to get their items. We have, it is a little bit slower currently, but you know, it'll pick up as soon as we get closer to the, the holiday itself. You know, every year I tell myself, you know, I'm going to, I'm going to, I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to start early and it doesn't happen, but this year I had to make sure that I actually get this, the holiday shopping started early so I can, you know, be able to afford everything that I have to buy, you know? I budgeted knowing that Christmas comes the same time every year and that inflation was still going to be high. I kind of budgeted uh, throughout the year to be able to get what I need to get done for Christmas.